quite busy. The Olympics will take place in different venues all over Tokyo and this is the metro station for the place where sport climbing and basketball free by free is gonna take a place so let's check it out well the place is essentially parking lot right now the advantage of climbing that we don't require a huge stadium we just need a free space and the climbing gym is essentially can be built in a couple of days right before the olympics i can't really imagine climbing right now <laughs> maybe the toughest part of the training will be getting used to this heat and humidity well there's not much to see but let's hang around a little longer have some lunch and Try to visualize the electric atmosphere. These machines are everywhere in Tokyo and it comes pretty handy in this heat because you get thirsty really really quickly. This is green tea and it's just regular green tea which is just cold. That's it. No sugar, no additives. It's, it's pretty cool. So I think according to the map, the Olympic Village should be those buildings up there. Still under construction but I think it's getting ready. Well. I would say it doesn't really look like Olympic Village, but more of an Olympic city. It's huge. All of this after the Olympics will be a huge residential area. We finally spotted some sign of the Olympics. I think that guy has pretty bad technique in climbing. It would be pretty difficult to move around without a cell phone. Definitely helps a lot. And fortunately, nowadays, especially at the trains, all the names are also written in the English. It's not always true for the buses though. We are heading to the Olympic Stadium. Let's check out which train to take. The yellow. Alright, let's go. It's still under construction, but it's almost ready. In one year, it's gonna be the main Olympic Stadium where the opening ceremony is going to take place. These were the Olympic venues, but now the task is to get qualified for the Olympics, which is here. World Championships has just started. <laughs> 